very much looking forward to what should be delivered to be delivered, but I'm not holding my breath in this litany of broken promises. The Honourable Clare Current. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Well, I'll do one better than a photo. I invite, pers this is a personal invitation to Simon O'Connor to come to Dunedin and I'll give him a tour through Dunedin Hospital, show him the leaks, show him, show him the, the, the bits that are roped off because of asbestos and where you have to wear a hazmat suit to go down to the basement to retrieve any records. Mr Speaker, I'd happily give him a tour and I expect him to turn up in Dunedin for it. Mr Speaker, when the foundations of the new Dunedin Hospital are laid by 2020, this government can hold its head up high because it has delivered on its promises. That previous national government sat on its hands, prevaricated, wasted tens of thousands, possibly hundreds of thousands of dollars on countless circular reports with no outcomes. No outcomes. And if it w that party was still in government, Dunedin would still be waiting for a hospital. It would continue to wait, possibly for decades, because it was going nowhere. Now, Simon Bridges is complaining that we're moving too fast on Dunedin Hospital. Well, the people of Dunedin will be, this government will deliver for the people of Dunedin. As the Kiwi build homes gather momentum, and a plan for emergency housing is in place, there's new rules for warm, dry homes, there's a winter energy payment. This government can hold its head up high because we have delivered. As the hundreds of thousands of new plantings of forestry are, pl are planted, this government can hold its head up high because we have delivered. As the regions stir and begin to prosper again, uh, this, with, with economic plans with investment in those regions, this government can hold up its head because we have delivered. As productivity lifts, as there is an actual economic plan in place, th this government can hold up its high because we have delivered. The scale of the challenge that we have, Mr Speaker, is enormous, with its urgent capital needs in hospitals, ageing school classrooms, a failure to plan for growth in the education system. There's years of neglect, uh, multi-billions of dollars of funding gap in Auckland Transport, a cri the Christchurch rebuild that is um, uh, beset by problems. We cannot make up for nine years of neglect with just one budget. But this is a budget that sets the foundations. It will set the foundations for that growth and we will hold our head up high because we will deliver and we'll deliver for all of New Zealand. All of New Zealand, not just some of New Zealand. Uh, Mr Speaker, we have a huge infrastructure deficit in New Zealand, bricks and mortar. Uh, trains, transport, jobs and a, and a real economic strategy, but we also have a huge social deficit in this country. And part of that is a culture issue, a culture issue across many of our go government agencies, um, a culture issue, uh, a culture issue across many of our go government agencies, which is a sick culture and a culture issue across our regions which are sick and tired and, and lacking in hope. These things take time to rebuild. That is what this government is rebuilding across our country. Um, it is, and that is evidenced by the urgent need for a mental health inquiry, by the need for investment in family violence. There's huge stress on our social services. That's what this government will deliver on, and we will hold our heads up high. When I sat in the, uh, uh, camped in my tent in the octagon last July, in the middle of winter, I had a woman come to me and say that she was told by MSD to go and buy a tent and that they might reimburse her. That is the culture that we need to change. That is, the, is evidence of the change that needs to happen right across our country uh, to rebuild hope. This government will deliver on a budget 
to um, reshape the foundations of our economy and our society, and we will deliver. Here, here. Here, here. The Honourable Shane Jones. Mr Speaker,